Sir, deterrence didn't work. What makes you think Vladimir Putin will alter course based on the action you've taken today? Let's get something straight. You remember, if you covered me from the very beginning, I did not say that, in fact, the sanctions would deter him. Sanctions never deter. You keep talking about that. Sanctions never deter. The purpose of the sanctions has always been and continues to be deterrence. The purpose of the sanctions in the first instance is to try to deter Russia from going to war. The president believes that sanctions are intended to deter. Our hope is that uh, Putin will decide to de-escalate, uh, that he will feel uh, the threat of the uh, sanctions, what the impact will be on the Russian economy, uh, on the Russian people, on the people who surround him. Uh, they are meant to have a deterrent impact, that he will feel the weight of being a pariah in the global community. No one expected the sanctions to prevent anything from happening. It has to show this is going to take time. The maintenance of sanctions, the increasing the pain, and the demonstration why I asked for this NATO meeting today is to be sure that after a month we will sustain what we're doing, not just next month, the following month, but for the remainder of this entire year. That's what will stop him. Before this invasion of Ukraine began, several administration officials representing the President of the United States, Joseph Biden, said, in fact, sanctions might deter that invasion. The President just said, again, emphatically, they don't deter. What they do is they sustain pressure over time, hoping to achieve a different result. Well, what's interesting, Pete, is the president just said that the sanctions and other measures they've taken were not about deterrence. And yet deterrence is a word we frequently hear from senior White House officials about the purpose of having financial constrictions on Russia. We heard just now from President Biden that deterrence is not essentially the strategy here. He said all of these sanctions are not aimed at deterring. They're essentially aimed at punishing, which, you know, is a message that the White House has really struggled with. We heard Vice President Harris repeatedly say that all the sanctions were about trying to deter Putin. President Biden reiterating that he did not believe that sanctions were meant to deter from the outset, despite what several members of his administration said. I mean, if the White House is sending a mixed message, I don't know how they think that Putin's going to get a clear message. This is literally his own team and himself saying that these sanctions were supposed to deter. And then him today in Brussels at NATO saying they were never supposed to deter. And anyone who says it is crazy. Yeah, just last month, the White House insisted that sanctions did serve an important deterrence role. Inconsistency is the only consistent theme of this administration at this point.